Native Beats. Hello, beautiful people. Welcome to my channel, Elsa Loves. It's been a while. Um, honestly, just because, just because. Um, so today, one, there's a couple of things. I have been trying to order a bunch of surprises because our anniversary is coming up. March 21st, 3 to 1. So there's that part in trying to be like sneaky when you live with someone is really hard. So I've planned out a lot. Um, I have a little weekend getaway where I'll post some pictures of what that's going to look like. I'll post them here. And I have a couple of gifts that I'm going to surprise her with. I'm not going to share that because that's more like private stuff. And so this Friday, we are going to go away. And I'm super excited about it because this is my first time. One thing you do not know about me, this is my first time keeping a surprise for this long. It has been, whew, <laughs> yeah, it has been a road because literally it's been a few months that I was like, definitely knew I was gonna go away because the current state we're in, we're not flying anywhere, but we're going away to a, a cottage as you saw in the photo. So we're going away to a cottage to a state next, like not too far from us, about an hour away. So I'm excited for that. Let me apply some chapstick. I'm still teaching. Teaching has been crazy. We're going in the building soon. Ah, so many updates. We're going in the building soon, which is I'm personally excited. I miss I love spending my day with kids. I love kids so much. So I cannot wait to actually see the kids in person because it has been a struggle for me to get online to teach. I can only imagine what it's been and felt like for kids to get online and learn. I personally did not like online classes for, you know, un when I did my undergrad in college, but, and also if you signed up for online classes, you likely knew you weren't going to be as engaged or do much on that class. Or maybe that's me speaking from personal experience, but that was like, oh, I can, you know, it's easy to like get away with doing the bare minimum. So one of my students are writing me right now, asking me what class he's in even though we've posted the schedule, but that's another topic. <laughs> anyway, so today I'm gonna get ready. I got out of work early today, an already early day, uh, and I am going to take, go get my vaccine, the first dose of it, and that's about 20 minutes away. So I'm gonna get ready for that. I was told to have short sleeves and stuff like that. So I'm gonna get ready for that, and I'll walk you through it with me. Um, let's see any other updates nope that's it so i'm gonna get ready this curly monday march 15th and even just making this video i feel excited because i'm like oh i kept the secret only only tuesday wednesday thursday friday literally in four days i could tell her and it's gonna be so hard because i so and the her i'm speaking about is my fiance um and <clears throat> I, I'm, we're going to play it out. Like I'm, we're going with my sister, my cousin, and it's going to be the four of us kind of having like a girl's weekend. Right. And the way we're going to trick her or play it, you know, have her not know about it is we're going to say, Hey, let's just go for a ride and let's just, you know, have a little Friday fun, go for a ride and we'll see where, you know, where the universe takes us type thing. And we're gonna end up at the cottage and we'll see how it goes i think i was gonna get a rental i haven't yet um just because i've been watching the weather and where i am it's might rain us uh, not rain snow which is crazy because literally this whole week has been super nice super super nice um but you know I believe everything happens for a reason. Maybe it's going to be beautiful. Maybe it'll keep the bears away. I read that there were bears there. I really hope not. Um, I mean, but there, it is a possibility. Um, we're going to be on a lake. Spliff I'm beats. so excited. I'm so excited. I can't wait to get away and just like, you know, play some games, have some drinks. Family time. I love family time. And it's been so hard to like even meet with anyone in a group because of our current state I, i'm sure i'm not alone in that 
Um, but yeah, so I have to go get my vaccine. My goal is to pack for her without her knowing, which please let me know. Would you be upset if your partner did this? Would you be upset if your part or would you be upset or would you appreciate if your partner packed for you and did it tell you when you were going away for a weekend? So going away Friday, coming back Sunday night. Is that is that am I setting myself up for failure here? But hear me out. <laughs> I think it's perfect because I, I or let me speak for myself. I, I would love that and just bring, you know, my my comfy clothes and my dress up clothes and I'm good. So I'm, I have a few outfits planned and because I am packing for her, I'm packing more than I would for that exact reason and and I I'm packing all all the things that that I think she'll need. So clothes, um makeup, wine. Uh, I already feel like I'm going to feel like this. <laughs> um face wash. Hmm. I think that's it. I honestly think that's it. I'm also debating if I'm waiting to put this video up on Friday because we she typically doesn't watch youtube so she doesn't really watch my chan my videos unless i say watch my videos so i'm i'm thinking i could get away with it but i've been holding the secret for like months at this point i don't think i should ruin it so i might upload this on friday so it is currently monday but i might upload this on friday so you're gonna see me get uh my vaccine and then i'll keep you posted i'll vlog our little mini getaway all right i'll see you in a moment Okay, so I just looked at the weather. It is 18 degrees and they want me to wear a short sleeve to have easy access. And literally, like I was saying earlier, it was 70, oh, not 70, that's exaggeration. It was like 60 degrees last week and now it is freezing, like literally freezing. Ugh. So we'll see what I figured out. Okay, I got dress. I put this purple wrap because um, my hair was kind of not doing what I needed it to do. Um, matched it with this little purple ribbon. I also put my shirt on that I have for my mom. When I feel like I need a little good good boost, I have my that shirt on. Um, then I have black pants. I'm sorry, gray pants, black shoes. So let's see. Okay, just to let you know, it is freezing. I'm glad I went this route because no, no, I can take off my sweater there. It is windy, cold. No, thank you. It's cold. Uh, hopefully they let me record while I'm in there. I don't know if they're actually going to let me record, so we'll see. Um, so we'll see. I'm gonna drive there now. It's about 20 minutes away, so we'll see. Okay, I am warming up my car. It is cold. Gonna get my Clementine. I forgot to take an Aleve just because it might be a little bit painful, but I think I'll be fine. Um, so yeah, we'll see how it goes. Okay, so I got it done. It was super smooth for the most part. Um, I went in thinking I was going to get one type of vaccine and then got another. That was a little like, ugh. Um, you know it was a moment but they ran out of the original vaccine that i thought i was going to get so um i got the other um vaccine which is also a really popular one it, it's fine i was smooth when i got in there there were like little it looked like a speed dating speed setup dates. almost because there was there were little tables set up and then chairs around it um about six feet apart whatever and you sat down and then the army was distributing the vaccines so it was pretty smooth it was fine i liked it um the people distributing the vaccines were actually really nice i was nervous that they were going to be like grumpy because they're there all day and they were pretty nice and then i actually saw a co-worker and we like talked for a little bit during you have to wait 15 minutes after and we've and we talked during that 15 minutes, so it went by really, really quick. And, oh, and they gave me a sticker, which is like a great incentive if you want people, even adults to do things, 
give them stickers it's funny um and this is no way by me telling you because i got the vaccine it's not me telling you to get the vaccine honestly do whatever you'd like i just ask that when you're in public regardless if you got the vaccine or not just be respectful of people consider your community um you know wear your mask be safe and whatnot um but yeah i think i'm going to end this video here and the next video what you will see you will see um our cottage and i think i'm gonna I, like i said earlier i think i'm gonna post this on friday so that she's not too suspicious or maybe i'll do friday morning i'll have it edited and ready and then um we'll see how this goes i don't know but i'm so excited thank you for coming along also i didn't um record while i was getting the vaccine because um <clears throat> i showed up five minutes late and i felt rude about it so i didn't honestly even ask i'm sure they would have but i completely forgot at that point but it was fine anyway um let me know what you think about the cottage um and tell me what was your favorite thing you've done for an anniversary date comment that down below also lupus awareness all right i'll see you next time